I believe from scripture, from church history, from biographies of Christian leaders throughout the 20th century, that every Christian is going to be tempted to lose their faith. If you're someone who is listening to this and saying, that's my story, I've lost my faith, this book is going to help you to be able to take steps toward coming back to that faith. This book is really for three audiences. It's for the 59 million Americans who are absolutely committed to the Christian faith, and yet their heart is broken every time a friend or loved one uh, is struggling with their faith or, or loses it. This book is for the 22 million Americans who have gone through a spiritual crisis, perhaps relational conflict. They've walked out of the church, and in many cases, uh, are either struggling with or have lost their faith. This book's also written for the 11 million Americans who haven't made a solid commitment of faith to Jesus Christ yet. They're in the church, but they're, they're struggling to come to faith and very well could walk away. One of the things that I've discovered for those who go through a crisis of faith and then re-embrace the Christian faith is they have a greater love for God. They love Him with all of their heart and soul and strength and mind because they have a so much more accurate picture of who God is and they have a greater love for their neighbor because they're not going to judge them anymore. They're willing to be compassionate and come alongside and help them come back. And my prayer is that God will use this book, the message in this book, to equip the church to have a ministry for the 22 million Americans who have gone through that spiritual crisis and are no longer in church, that we'll be willing to listen to their story 